Hey amazing people, today I want to do a special video about my YouTube journey. That is, to look at my first videos and see how much I improved and to have a bit of fun. I feel like I've improved a lot, so I would like to go back and have some fun with you about my mistakes. Maybe by looking at this video you will laugh and learn a thing or two about making videos. So let's do just that. Let's go to YouTube and let's start with my first video from my channel which is a video about launching my first paid product. The title of this video is how I made $4,000 with my first product and you can see it right here. First of all it feels like I just woke up before recording this video and maybe I did. The audio quality is super bad and look at this quality, look at the resolution, damn, so bad. Let's actually make it bigger. <laughs> God damn, you can see how bad the video quality is and the audio, damn. I just skim through so we don't listen to everything because it's a little bit annoying. I don't know what microphone I had because it's super super bad. And I think I was recording myself with the MacBook camera, which if you look here is not that bad because it's just that small circle and it's just a small image. But if the image would be full screen, it would look so bad. Okay, we can move further. It's super clear that this video is very bad. It's bad in terms of video quality, audio quality and everything. Even the resolution is not the right one, it's a much bigger one which makes it very hard to see this stuff. Yeah, so the verdict is meh. Let's move to the next one. The next video is learn how to go from zero to paid articles. So let's see what I did because I don't remember honestly. Okay, if the first video was bad, this one is worse. Look at this quality, look at this, <laughs> look at this screen and look at my glasses yeah Katalin, good job look at the eyes reading from the screen <laughs> i didn't even try to mask it i was just plain reading in front of the camera and i had zero likes at this i don't know how 600 views and zero likes and look again at the resolution here you can't see anything okay let's move a bit yeah st still reading my article from my blog but it's not this one so yeah i think i had my macbook in front of my big screen and i was reading from my macbook and this is my external screen i think because this one doesn't move okay it's clear that i <laughs> i read from the macbook let's move further still reading still reading oh look here showing how to apply for the free code camp publication i can't believe it when i look at my latest videos and now i present my article where you can find publications that pay you to write for them again the verdict is the video is super bad from all aspects let's go to the next one why you don't have to be a super developer even if the idea behind this video is nice i'm afraid to open that video and here i am again reading from the screen because it's super clear i'm reading from the screen look at the eyes even if it's not that obvious compared to the last video i still read from somewhere super cringe super cringe yeah the same background look i'm creating presentations now so it's a big step so again reading from my macbook Let's move to the next one. The next one is Hashnode versus Dev.2. Which blogging platform to choose? Okay, the sound is messed up because you can hear properly. The resolution is messed up, it's not that good. This video is two minutes long, almost three. My lighting is super bad in all these videos. I don't know what was going through my head. The audio quality is bad as well. And I'm not even talking about the video quality. <laughs> yeah but we all start somewhere so let's move to the next one which is how to contribute to open source projects as a beginner so you can see again the lighting i have a shadow behind me it's super bad the audio is the same super bad i still used my laptop microphone i think but at least i learned how to edit with davinci you can see that I cut scenes and I made a smooth cut between them. Look at this. Look at this magic. 
you see that um, I think this one is a big improvement compared to others look I even have this fancy stuff down here yeah bad as well I think I started to record with my Logitech webcam C920 which I don't like at all so let's see which one is the next video and here is the next video let me mute it so I got a bit demoralized and I started to pay someone to create these videos with voiceover this one has mixed results you can see it has 85 likes and almost 1k views which is good for a channel of my size but I wasn't happy with this one because I'm not improving if I upload these videos I am not getting comfortable in front of the camera and I don't improve at all so I stopped doing them moving fast forward let's look at my latest videos here I started to record with Sony ZV-1, I upgraded my lighting, my audio, my camera and everything and you can see a world of difference. It's a big 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 difference between them and I'm super happy with how far I've came considering that I started with no equipment or super bad equipment, I had no confidence and basically I was super bad in the beginning therefore what I wanted to emphasize with this video is that everyone starts from somewhere we all start with bad equipment or no equipment at all we don't have confidence at first we don't know how to speak in front of the camera basically it's super hard to start recording videos because you need maybe not that much equipment but you still need some equipment and you need that confidence to speak when the camera is recording at first it was super super weird to look into the camera and talk alone and i was speaking like a robot i didn't move i spoke like that i didn't make pauses no body language no nothing you can see it's quite annoying and you can learn how to speak and you can learn how to move your body so you are not like a robot I've came a long way and I really like the direction I'm going in and with this video I hope to motivate you to continue your journey or to start your journey or to have more faith in yourself because as you can see we all start from somewhere and I was super bad and that still didn't stop me to put my videos out so if you have any questions regarding my journey I mean my YouTube journey my equipment and everything else I'm more than happy to answer them in the comments so drop them below and I'll answer them I hope you had a laugh about me the videos were super cringe super bad super poor quality and so on I agree but I improved and that's what that matter